is a view. Okay, and only I am pinned, so only I will be recorded. Okay, so I'm going to get started. So I'm going to place people on mute just while I do that. Just meet yourself with that. Yeah, just meet yourself with how you are this new year. Yeah, just have just a thought in mind, just to meet yourself, just an intention. Um, might be relaxation for this period, whatever it is. Just give it a thought and then just make sure that you are occupying what comfort looks like for you today. And then just gently close your eyes. And then let's just start by listening. Let's just listen to what sounds are entering mm -hmm. our ears. Mm -hmm. And let's find some gentle separation between ourselves and the environment that surrounds us. So just taking a little longer than usual. This is in our calendar, a brand new year. So let's just meet ourselves there and just listen to the sounds as if they were all new. This can just help us and support us in not following the narrative of that sound, the story behind it or the story that it invites us to take. And by this time, the sounds within your head, that are thoughts that make up our thoughts, our to-do lists, our regular routine that will be starting to pull at us, again to lead us into a story or a narrative. Again, let's just try and hear those thoughts as if they were new, as if we don't know what they're pulling us towards. Creating space for ourselves, creating space for ourself to rest. to 
just be so not ignoring the thoughts not ignoring the sounds just creating a space a space where we can meet ourselves and allow ourselves just to let go and you might want to let go maybe of some tension some tension that's just brought your your mind and your thoughts to meet it we can let go by just imagining a beautiful blue light so just picture in your mind's eye or outside of the body a beautiful blue radiant light and what this light is going to do is it's just going to illuminate part of the body that my voice invites you to look at and we're going to start first of all by bringing the light into our mouth and looking at the tip of our tongue and then the back of our tongue just getting used to the light so the tip of the tongue and then the back of the tongue and then just bringing that light to the tip of the tongue and then to the lips and then the right cheek and the left cheek and then the right eye and the left eye and then the space between our eyebrows and then the very top of our head and then down our right side to our right shoulder and then across to our left shoulder and then the whole of our right arm that soft blue light just illuminating and then the left arm and then the right palm of our hand and the left palm of our hand And then just bring the blue light 
back up to our collarbone and then into the center of our chest and then down to our navel and then the whole waist and then the right side of our body and then the left side of our body the beautiful blue light just illuminating the whole of our body And then almost magnifying the detail of our right calf and our left calf, <laughs> our right ankle and our left ankle. down into the ball of the right foot and then the ball of the left foot and then the whole of the blue light just connecting with each cell of the body And if we feel unsure or fearful of the cells, then that's, that's okay. We don't need to follow that narrative the same as our thoughts and the sounds. Just acknowledge our feeling. And in that feeling, there's a, a sort of letting go and a softening and a relaxing. resting and then so this blue light that's shining on us and in us just see if you can make that light a little brighter so that it's a cool blue, uh, sky blue, just picturing that colour as a point of focus, and you might feel bigger or smaller as you relax in this cool blue light and then just see if you can just picture a darker blue almost a richer velvety navy blue almost like switching a light switch so 
So see if you can feel the texture of the colour. And then go back to light blue again. And again, if you get annoyed or frustrated going from one extreme of light and darkness, just think if that has any meaning in this relaxed state because that's what we're doing at this time of year. It's very dark, but we've already welcomed the light back in and yet it's still dark. So we, we have these extremes. Sometimes we flow from one, from the light and the darkness and it's seamless and at other times we get frustrated with ourselves. Let's see if you can step back from that frustration. And then just go back to the light blue and just see if you can feel that colour and then just dropping all sense of colour. See if you can picture or feel a beautiful waterfall in front of you and just you might hear it or see it just beside it you're perfectly safe and relaxed and then just see if you can touch the water and if you can touch the water see if it feels different from right to left and just see if you're able to imagine yourself drinking some of this water from your hands or maybe a glass, a crystal glass appears and you just, this water just illuminates inside just renewing and refreshing as it passes through almost like this time of year this time of year just symbolizing the light and the dark and the new year ahead And again, we, we don't want to follow the narrative of that new year or of the year ahead because we're not living in that year ahead. We're right here. And right at this moment, just relaxing, 
just maybe hearing the water, welcoming the water into our body. And then just letting it all go. So just letting the imagery go. Letting the sensations go, the feelings, the thoughts. So practicing a form of non-attachment. just becoming aware of our restful state, almost looking at ourselves in the room that we're occupying and just becoming aware of the parts of our body that are in contact with the surface beneath us. So the back of the head, and the shoulders, the whole of the spine and the hips, the back of the thighs, the back of the calves, and the heels and the balls of the feet. Just really coming back Maybe starting to bring some movement in, or maybe starting to de deepen our connection with the surface beneath us, maybe feeling it with our hands, or bringing some gentle movement into our fingers, and then mirroring that in our toes. And then bring your eyes again with a sense of renewal, opening them with that downward gaze, just as if we're letting the light in for the first time, meeting ourselves exactly where we are. And just taking just our own time, just to come back, come back into the room, maybe have a drink and a stretch. Just to let you know that you're going to hear a louder voice which says recording stopped. So I'm just going to stop the recording, just doing, just warning you of that because it can make you jump. <laughs>